Hello and welcome to the Reboot Speedrunning Tutorial. This is the advanced route for level 4. Uh, this is one of the harder early tear glitches to perform in the game. There's some fairly tight timing you need to, you need to manage here. Uh, if you can take a little damage uh, before the first tear, as is often the case with the early tear glitch, that can be good. But regardless, we want to do the same route as normal, grab the first key and the rockets on the way uh, to the first tear. For the death abuse in this level, as always, we need to wait 10 or 12 seconds before dying. Uh, I recommend waiting for this platform to come down again and then crushing yourself on the side of the platform. If you just kind of drift through the side there, it will tear through your health. I recommend doing that because that pretty much guarantees you a good platform cycle coming back here. Uh, after that, we still want to go for the second key before the second tear. If you fail the platforming to the second key, I actually recommend going to the second tear first, instead of trying for the key again. It is incredibly important, I mean, as always, with the early tear glitch, uh, mending the second tear immediately is of utmost importance. The third tear should spawn fairly quickly here. There it is. It might be worth waiting a moment after mending the second tear. Um just so that cutscene doesn't play right as you're about to make that jump. Also, you may have noticed as I made this jump, the health car thing uh, was kind of in my way. Watch out for the car cycles in this area. Uh, the cars are consistent in the way they move, and so if you notice that one car is getting in your way often, that will keep happening. So you should be aware of that and adjust for it in the future. And then, as per normal, get the third key, meant the third tear. In my beginner route video for this level, I mentioned using the box gun to freeze the ABC tank um, to jump up here. You actually don't need the box gun for this. It just makes it a lot easier. I'm I'm gonna give this a one try <laughs> right now. Uh, like I said, you probably usually won't end up on a cycle that's good for this. Ooh, almost, almost. You likely usually won't end up on a cycle that's good for that, but it's it's possible you will. And that can save a little time if you can get that quickly. Uh, I will also mention here the extra life in this level. It doesn't lose much time to get if you want to come over here and then jump over to this platform on the way to the third tear. That's only a couple of seconds. Um, yeah, it, it can be worth going for that if you feel like you're running low on lives with all of the death abuses you're doing. And I assume if you're doing the early tear glitch in this level, you're probably already doing the early tear glitch in a lot of levels. This is... I think I said this already, but this is one of the hardest ones in the game to do, so... This is really only a... Uh, last levels of optimization kind of route that you want to do. If you have any other questions, feel free to leave them in the comments below or ask in the Discord.